Hello everyone, Mr. Storkin here, and welcome back to Pokemon Violet. Today we're continuing our look at all the new Pokemon, which is starting off with the new evolutions, especially with the Duraludon from my nickname, Tori, because for some reason Game Freak didn't want me to call it, and I kid you not, Skyscraper. But we're going to evolve this over to Artaludon, its new evolution, and you're probably wondering, how do you do that? Well, the simple thing is, well, you have to um, evolve it using a particular item called the Metal Alloy. JJK, right here. Use the Metal Alloy on um, Duraludon to evolve into Archiludon, which has become an even bigger skyscraper. What Tori is evolving? Yeah, I need it off the Tori's Tower. Blame me. Congratulations, your Tori evolved into Archiludon. Sorry, there was a bit of a lag going on. I'm just like, oh crap. Anyway. Uh, we have registered this into our Pokemon. It digs holes on mountains searching for food. Um, it's so durable that being high in the cave in won't phase it. That's good to know. Um, so we're going to do a quick gameplay around 12 minutes of it, because that's what we do. With Archer Loot on. And it wants to learn Electro Shot. Cool. I'll be okay with that move. Um, we're going to get rid of Focus Energy for that, actually. One, two, and ta-da. So yeah, this is a Nair Galarian Pokemon that got a new evolution, which feels rather... Um, early all things consider because um it looks like a stapler from behind like a staple puller i don't know if anyone knows that before i guess it's supposed to be steel beam but it just looks like a um a staple puller that you would have in your office am i the only one seeing that because it looks it looks just like it <laughs> anyway um let's see how well we can do guys a metal burst uh, let's do that oh you're using last resort interesting but it failed Again, looks like a staple folder. It's gonna do nothing, doesn't it? Yep, thought so. Well, let's use Dragon Claw because why not? Oh, you had to use Thunder Gym too. Was, whoa, that did a lot more than I thought. At least, wow, and paralyzed us too. That is not good. But it has stamina, which is great, so it increases defense. I love stamina. Oh, come on, I couldn't move. That's just sad. We're off to a great start with uh, Archer Loot on, aren't we? Um, so far, nothing. Entertainment, okay. It's going to confuse us, right? Okay, you require plus. Uh, not really what I want. Oh, are you kidding me? We are doing horrible in this fight already. And it's not even like the first one. This is ruining my experience in this Pokemon. Um, anyway, this is the evolution of uh, Duraluton, who, if you don't know, is um, Rayan's. I think it's Rayan. Uh, Ryan, I don't know if it's Ryan. I know people are like, that's your name. It's like, I don't know if it is like that. I prefer M8, by the way. Um, but it is the new evolution of that. So I wonder if, like, down the line, if they make a, um... Oh, I feel really odd saying them making the Sword and Shield remake. Because that feels like really, really, really long-term. Like, not happening until, like, 2050. I could be wrong. No, not until, like, 2030, I think. But anyway, um, I think he would have it down the line. I don't know what that Pokemon is in the distance. Sorry, the thing that's just kind of sitting there. No, it's... Oh, it's a Plusle. Doy. Um, so we're going to use a Joltik here. Let's just use Dragon Claw because we can just annihilate the Joltik. Wow. It was caught off guard, but it couldn't move. Good. We're going to use Electroshock because that's its new move. Where it looks like a cannon and a bridge. So it's a bridge. Okay. Increase? Wow, I thought it would be like an attack. Interesting. I feel kind of lied to. I really do feel lied to about this. Oh, now it goes off. Cool. So it kind of just builds up. That's just no. Okay, that's kind of cool. It's kind of like a gun or a cannon. Like a, a can gun. I, I'm not good with word plates. I'm, I'm, I don't know what to call it. Anywho, uh, let's be up some more Pokemon. Actually, I want to go after uh, Meteor. Mini, mini or this mini horse seems like something I'd be, like, just having fun destroy. Uh, we're going to use, uh, we'll see a flash can. This is super effective, and we also going to see that epic bridge stuff. Oh, the Joltik got curious as it used an explosion. Okay, this can't go well. Actually, I don't know how Wow, it did, like, nothing to us. Okay, somehow the plus hole was more effective with its, uh, um, Thunderbolt, which is kind of sad. Uh, but anyway, um, I don't want to bounce, uh, ground attacks. I know it feels out like, why'd you go in here then? Let's go up against this. This is a mining, because puzzle. oh, it's a puzzle. Sorry, mining is the blue one. 
I get them confused all the time because they're very easy to get confused. So, yeah. Last resort? Really? So soon. But it failed. Um, I would like you all to also, if you enjoy this content, I enjoy making this content. So if you enjoy this content, be sure to like, comment, subscribe. Because we will be covering more of the Pokemon content. I know it's like, why are you talking about this in the middle of the thing? Because it's just like, ah, I can talk about whenever I want with this giant stapler. It looks like a giant stapler. It also looks like a bridge, and I get the point. It's a bridge, but I just... Oh, why I battled the ground type of one? That was stupid in it. But we have some moves to actually fight against it. Um, I actually wonder, if there was a black and white remake, would you, any of you guys use Drill Burr? I could be talked into using Drill Burr. I really could in my team. Just because it's a different type of Pokemon. But at the same time, I save... Um, oh, what's its name? It says Matilda as my ground type. What are you talking to using Drill Burr? Anyway. Semantics, I know. We're going to use a flash can to annihilate it, because why not? And take that drill bird, you are down for the count. So yeah, I, I, I again, um, it's very interesting that they decided to give a bunch of um, new, um, sorry, Galarian Pokemon. Evolution because again, Gal Galar was just the um, region before. Maybe these Pokemon were scrapped, and they were just like, um, we have these really good ideas for these evolutions of the previous Pokemon, but we never really had a chance to use them, and then the boss is like, yeah, charge them um, DLC for it. And as much crap as the Pokemon DLC gets, I'm going to openly defend it. It's one of the better DLCs I've experienced, um, which is saying something because I experienced DLC that's just utter horrible. But anyway, it's always good to have stamina. I love stamina because I actually go against an Elkid. I never really used um, the Elkid line in any of my Pokemon playthroughs. It's just because it requires the Electri uh, Electrize to evolve, and I don't really want to have a Pokemon that requires them um, training to evolve. Um, that's why we had a problem with Hocus Pocus last time. I really want Hocus Pocus to be part of my team in, um, in, um, what's the word I'm looking for here? In, um, really Diamond Shining Pearl. I had him on my team, and I did want him to be, um, a member of our team, but because we had to evolve it into, um, Alakazam through trade, um, it didn't quite work. Let's go against the Magnemite. I know it's a really questionable decision to make there, but we're going to do it. Also, this is where you can capture some Porygons and Porygon Z's. I have not yet um, encountered um, Elverse. It's not going to do anything. But failed! Yep. Yeah, um, Any Beldums? Beldums are here, and Beldums are really rare, especially helping with the um, completion of the Pokedex. Um, Okay, it's just building up energy, which I'm okay with as long as it doesn't use Fake Out, which I don't think it will use Fake Out, because Magnemites are not known for having Fake Out in their moves. Mm, middle Sound. Good job, Tori. You avoid it. I'm very proud of you about that. Um, and we'll just fire that at you. So, um, I know people have... Oh, it did, like, nothing. <laughs> yeah, none of the moves are going to do much because it's the same... Borderline, same typing. Uh, let's just use Dragon Claw, then, because that will do some damage. Um, so, yeah... Um, people probably will wondering what tomorrow is going to be. Um, I'm leaning towards doing the new Paradox Pokemon. Even, I, even though I don't have the, um, new, um, man, why can't I find the words? Um, the new Raikou or the new Entei. But that will just be added to my whole list of Paradox Pokemon I need to get. Let's destroy a plus all because vengeance. I'm, I kid, but I want vengeance on it. So yeah, we're going to use, uh, we don't really have any Dragon Type moves, unfortunately, which is odd. Really odd. No, we have Dragon Claw. Duh. I feel so stupid. I, I could be talking to Terrastalizing, um, Archaludon for the sake of that, which I think I'll do in the next battle. Because, yeah, we make these videos around 12 minutes because then people just, like, keep back relaxing and have enjoy them. I hate getting plus because it ruins my stamina. And Stamina is a wonderful ability. It's what made my Mudsails really overpowered. Like, stupidly overpowered. Um, yeah, I had, I, I had Mudsdales two generations in a row. I'm, I'm, I'm proud of that. That's not like someone trying to hide. But what I liked about that, sorry, there was also a um, Metang up there by the um, center. I want to do that for the battle. Anyway, um, I'm sorry, Mudsdales. I, all my Mudsdales had Stamina. Between that and Moxie... I have some pretty powerful ground type Pokemon. For those who don't know, my um, Crocodile in my Black and White 2 playthrough, which you can check on the channel, which feels odd because that was like so long ago. Um, since those videos came out like ridiculously long time ago. 
Um, which is odd to take a look back at, but my crocodile had um had s oh that's a uh, trainer's uh, med tank. I feel so wrong. But let's go after the exodus. That's stupid because it's level seventy. It's like ten levels above us. That was stupid. I mean, incredibly stupid. So we're just gonna run away. Thank you for actually letting us get away safely. And I guess we'll just fight um a minor, and then we'll use our uh, not mega evolution our terror type. Duh. Oh, I'm sorry, there's something actually in the distance. Well, that's the web area. Where they have some of the, um, the Joltik in its evolution. I can't remember Joltik's evolution on the top of my head. Again, um, Nova is one of the reasons I have a lot of problem with. Mainly the reason why I want them to do a remake of it. Um, I want to replay it. I want to replay X and Y, too. Actually, recently I found my old camera. I used to record some of the 3DS games from, and I actually kind of wanted to just go through it because I was seeing something in there that I wanted to get. Well, that did nothing. Well, it's going to use explosion. I don't know how it will affect our driving typing. I think it would affect our steel typing more. Wow, that almost killed us. Impressive. I'll give credit for credit surrender. Okay. Actually, I wish it was uh, electric type because then our um, electric type moves would have done a bit more. I'm actually going to go in and full restore real fast because why not? And then we're going to head on to the electric web area. And then we'll do, I think, two more battles. Wee! And then one of the part. Hello, Elekid. Um, oh, there's a Terra Puff on there. Um, Electos. What level is the Electos? I'm not battling that. I like to make it Let's go up to Galva Ultra. Galva Ultra. Sorry, I can't speak for some reason. We'll battle two of them, and then we will end the part. I'm going to use Dragon Claw Force. Oh, it's either or less use the Terra type. Okay. Bug buzzed it a lot. I'm surprised. But we got stamina, so our defense had just increased. Where my dragon claw, which did nothing. Okay. Um, I'm going to try flash cam, but I won't do a whole lot. Okay, you can use screech, which I think lowers our defense. Yeah, very harshly, it says. But again, I just like seeing that can ability. Do I like it, this Pokemon, more than Hydrapple? People are probably wondering. No, I really don't. Hydrapple, I like better. Gastro Acid. That's a new move. Okay, so I can't get any more stamina right now. That's kind of sad, but okay. I understand the risk. I get it. I get it. I don't like it, but I get it. Um, what can we bow for? Let's bow the Mag Magne Magneton as our final opponent. Because, again, why not? It's something different. You know, I even though it still looks like a state controller, I can't, I, I can't get it past my head. I'm going to use the Electro Shot because that's a special move. Absorb the electricity. Well, if it used an electric type move on me, would I absorb that electricity and use it again? It was Cough Guard, so I'm okay with that. I can just fire the electric thing at it. It would do like nothing. Whoa, that did a lot more than I thought. I'm proud of that. <laughs> Okay, that was impressive. That was that was great. It did a lot more than I was ever ex hoping or expecting it to do. Uh, but we're going to use the Dragon Claw. So I finish you off like so. And I'm proud of that victory, too. As the nice how fainted. So, yeah. Okay, so good job, Seabiscuit. Well, anyway, I'd like to thank you oh so much for watching this video. Oh, yeah, this is also where you can get some rounds, by the way. So much for watching this video. It was very fun to make. I love taking a look at these Pokemon. Um... Tomorrow we're going to head off to Area Zero to take a look at some of the Paradox Pokemon. But until then, be sure to like, comment, subscribe, and we'll see you guys in the more exciting Scarlet and Violet DLC. That's it for me, and well, bye bye